A good poem steadily sweeps against your boundaries until unknowingly it breaks a wall and floods you. This is Sunil Bhandari and you are listening to Uncut Poetry. Of rain engulfed rooms and lovers in spate. What is love she complained without memories of rain? I wish I could be enveloped in grey in rooms filled unendingly with you and a percussion of calm. The bed with deep shadows of mine and fleeting traces of struggles. Your skin damp as I lay full on you, your ragged breath tired from exploring my ruins. The day would be far gone, my body past noon, the light a jealous witness, your passion seeking breath. But who's to tell in rooms where time demurs to stop? I hold you tiny in my palm and look at your face, the calm changing slowly, a line drawn complete. I lazily see puddles dully glinting on window sills and I ask you to rain on me. I ask you to rain on me again. I lazily see puddles dully glinting on window sills and I ask you to rain on me. I ask you to rain on me again. Rain amongst all seasons is as much feeling as occurrence. In spite of all its deleterious effects on roads, homes, countries, log jammed lanes, traffic jams, leaky roofs, economic devastations, it can never be bereft of its poetry, its memory of growing pangs, its mat occurrences of comfort, tea and satisfying dissatisfactions. Everyone has a rain-infused remembrance. The peerless newsletter The Nook had a get-together to reminisce about people and their memories of rains. It said, One of the participants brought with them the rains of Carol, with their many names and each a peculiar character. Another told of the monsoons in the hills, of mothers and grandmothers climbing concrete roofs and fixing them while children hold buckets and gather stones that roll off. We shared stories of running across paddy fields, our feet tickling, tales of a small family on a three-wheeler devouring patties that we too could taste in our mouths. We were transported to a bustling street in Delhi, brought to its knees by the rain. We became kids floating paper boats in puddles, lovers stealing a kiss in the back seat while the drivers distracted by the romance of the windshield wipers and the rain. Indeed, for lovers, the rains are the perfect playlist. Gentle, harsh, Insistent, soothing, the world inside finds a rhythm with the world outside. Being inside a time when time doesn't matter is life's finest benediction, one which lovers embrace with casual ease, knowing, possibly for the first time in their lives, that the world can wait. And that then is the bittersweet legacy of the monsoons of being so close to life that thereafter it doesn't matter and then to immediately lose that lesson. In living through the rains, we are filled to the brim with both life's grace and possibilities if only we let the aftermath be a continuum. This is Sunil Bhandari and you are listening to Uncut Poetry 
If you enjoyed this poem, rate it on Spotify or leave a comment on Apple Podcast. And I have a lovely newsletter called The Uncuts, which is like a Sunday dollop of warmth and fun and beauty. Subscribe to it. The link is in the show notes. And if you loved this episode, please do share it with someone you love. See you next week.